You gotta come in the, the frame. My calves didn't <laughs> hurt until after I jumped off of that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so obviously you gotta watch out for dog poop. Yeah, yeah, I, I noticed that. <laughs> because now you're barefoot. Yep. Funsies. <laughs> More there too. So this is Ray. If somehow future self forgets. <laughs> I don't know. I could go through another like five names before then. <laughs> oh, I don't know. That's true. So, Ray is here to work out today because Ray wants to get in better shape. And so she asked me to be that person to help her do that. So, yay for you. So, however, Ray has like never worked out a day in her life. So, <laughs> it's not. So, because of this though, she's severely behind for her age. How old are you? 22 now. Yeah, see, 22. So what we're doing is we're gonna get her caught up because she's also doing martial arts with me as well. And so um, we get to have a, it's not it's gonna be a small workout today, but it's gonna be efficient. So we're gonna do what's called bear crawls. Have you ever seen those before? They sound vaguely familiar, but I can't like do it without being shown. <laughs> <laughs> well, I will show you. The I know it's going to make me suffer. So uh, my only current concern, I don't think it's a big deal, but I'm letting you know anyway, in case okay. it becomes a problem, is since yesterday, every once in a while, I'll do. I don't know who that was. <laughs> I don't know who that was either. Every once in a while, I'll get a stabbing pain in my knee, but it's always really quick and it's over really quickly. But letting you know in case it becomes a problem, because I don't know what it is. Okay. <laughs> So, what we're gonna do for bear crawls is basically you get on. Yeah, full rotation. Uh, you're not gonna be on your knees, but you're gonna be on your hands and knees. Like this. And then you crawl like so. It's like a little alligator. My hands and feet are supposed to be moving at the same time, or is it, <laughs> does it matter? I think mine actually moves. I think mine moves at the same time okay. on the same side. So one side moving at a time. All right. Don't worry so much about the pattern. It's more so a height thing to worry about. You don't want, you don't want to be. You don't want to have your like, butt way up in the air <laughs> like this. You don't want to do this. That sounds easier though. <laughs> you think that until like all your weight is on your arms now, uh, instead of being distributed out evenly over your body. Okay, valid. So, and then your back is gonna hurt. And That's probably too close. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. I cannot do it as gracefully as you do it. <laughs> This is easy. My body just moves like a robot. One side, other side, other side. You're not really graceful, but I think after you get used to using this motion to move your body forward, then it'll become easier and easier. No. <laughs> Don't worry. How about this? Don't think about the motion of the mechanic. Just go. Just crawl, basically. Just, just crawl. With my knees off the ground. Yep. Just, just go. We're gonna eat dirt. This is fine. See, that's not so bad. I hate the fact that they added speakers out here because sometimes whatever the playlist is becomes really ominous. Late at night, there's fog and stuff. It's called Slay With Bells. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, that shit was playing one night. It was like three o'clock in the morning. There was fog out here. You couldn't see nothing and you just hear that. Christmas, right? Though it'll be over soon. I hope so. Uh, it's, it's awful. You gotta make it for five laps <laughs> on your hands and feet. <laughs> yep. Around the square. Okay. Melanie did it before you. Melanie she, is way more in shape than I am. Oh uh, no, she didn't make it. But. <laughs> She did it before you, and she also couldn't make Here's it Melanie. that far. Yeah. So this is why you have to do five laps now instead of ten. <laughs> so I thought 
So you should thank Melody. <laughs> thank you, Melody. A few inches later. How's it going? My hands are on fire. <laughs> I thought about giving you gloves, but you said you wanted the authentic experience. Was the authentic experience on concrete? No, that's like stone. I'm gonna be a little smoother. <laughs> <laughs> so like, I heard about second wind and stuff when you're exercising, right? I got that on that corner of the first lap. Yeah. And so after that, I don't, all of this was like, it feels like in a video game where you have mana, right? And you have like, when you're overusing your mana and you're like, you have to wait to get like five mana back so you can use that five mana to make a <laughs> tiny movement. Yeah. And that's where I've been for this, this past path. Like basically, if you were to run while being on all fours, do you think you could do that? No. <laughs> you don't remember when I tried in the grass originally where you like go faster and then I just kind of ate dirt? <laughs> Okay, so. I'm not great. <laughs> uh, at least once you just finish the second lap before freaking what looks like thunderstorm weather shows up. Ah, shit, I'm moving to the grass. My lap is now bigger. So like, it does not look pretty up there. No, it does not. I'm not even sure like, what's the range of these microphones? Oh, I guess we're gonna test. Do you not need to click anything to turn mine back on? Automatically back on when you start recording. It's still on. The lights are on. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't think it ever turned off. It has seven hours of use time. <laughs> That's pretty nice. It takes two hours for fully charged, seven hours of use. Only takes two hours to charge. Do you have enough stuff to charge them both at the same time or do you have to charge them separately? No, you charge them all at the same time. It came with three like cables. Three. Three, yeah, because two mics and one receiver. This is what I meant by galloping. See, this is why I asked, because horses don't do front together, back together, unless they're jumping. So I actually adjusted the camera now uh -huh. to be on manual mode. What that means is, it's a more cinematic look of what our day looks like. Because at first, the footage looked super bright. Like it was almost really bright outside. But it's actually starting to get darker. And so now, it's a more like accurate look of what everything actually looks like. So when we was out here, it was not that dark. It was like 2.30. And right now it is 4.40. Does that help? It helps a little bit. Oh look, we're almost there. You're almost there. Oh, living all the Veggie has improved. Oh my god, 181. No, 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 no. What the hell is that? Yeah. My microphone's not here. Oh. Why do I feel like you're lying? There's definitely it's a my, camera. It's my. Hello. <laughs> Came all the way back in time for this. How's it feel? Terrible. I've been here for a week. Come out of Dallas to see these nice, beautiful folk, and this is how they treat me. You used to talk shit to them. They, no, that's a lie. Why would you say that? I've been nothing but kind to these people. They beat my ass in this game. I don't deserve this kind of treatment. I get this with five years of my career. And this is what I get. This is the thanks that I get. You're fine, Matthew. You're good. I personally. No, I will. Yo, look at my door, man. Um, it's down here now. Did you break the door? I can break it. Not you. I gotta put this back up here. Somehow. Eh, it'd be alright, I guess. I want to take a quick second to have this talk with you guys. 
or with myself about something I've been thinking about heavily. And no, it's not the Cardi B poster. It's a tapestry, actually, and it's really nice. Cardi B is my spirit animal. I love everything she does. I love everything about her. She's awesome. Anywho, the thing I want to talk about is something that I'm calling or I'm coining the term a... I'm coining the term labor debt. A labor debt is a debt that you have to pay back in work because of work that you haven't completed earlier on. So what that means is um, I like to use the, the example of a pet, like a puppy, for example. If you get a puppy, it's cute, it's fluffy. You want to pet it and love it and hug on it and everything. But you have to take time to train that puppy to know what is okay and not okay or rather acceptable in our human society because he's a puppy, he doesn't know any better, he's just a wild animal, um, pretty much listening to his instincts. So, you have to train this puppy because an undisciplined puppy turns into an undisciplined dog. And there's sometimes some of the things of the puppy not listening, or not paying attention, or not knowing stuff, chewing on stuff, and doing all these things. It's cute when they're tiny and they're cute and they're fluffy, but it's not cute when they're big. Now it's an annoyance, it's a problem, and it's not just a problem for you, it's sometimes it's a problem for other people. So I wanted to coin this term a labor debt, for example. And so there's always situations in my life that I will find myself in a, between a rock and a hard place. And it's usually because of work that I didn't do beforehand. And that's something I'm trying to work on is pulling myself out of labor debt and basically pushing myself to be in a better position in the future and not be so far behind of work that I'm owing myself. And I don't want to keep dealing with these consequences of work I haven't done in the past. So that's something I'm working on. Have y'all ever been in a situation where you find yourself working on a problem that you have only because of some work you didn't do before. That's something I want y'all to think about. And, you know, if anybody's watching this far in the video, comment section down below. And um, it's your boy Nitro High Fire. Like I said, I'm making this as a video diary. Most of these videos are for myself. And um, so if nobody's watching, I'm going to at least look back on this in the past. Well, no, I'm look back, back on this in the future to see how far I've come and how far I've grown. It's your boy Nitro Hot Fire. I'm out. Peace.